Ow, I hate being sick, but I get to make so many videos without having to stop or pause. <laughs> talk to me, talk. <sighs> Naughty dog. How many games did Naughty Dog make? I should probably set up on YouTube. Well, my phone. Well, my phone's pretty bad for them. Uh, uh, so this is episode what three? Yeah. When you that bored? Playtime's over. Okay, I'm done. Sorry, I can play this game for me. Wait, I forgot something. killed each other for a piece of this. You were up there a long time. Oh, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. There we go. Probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. It looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? <laughs> what? Hmm? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm-hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm-hmm. I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm hmm Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? No, oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh dear that lord. Kind of so, some boring stuff. But tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is gonna like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs like the second that you got off the plane. So, I'm gonna take this to YouTube. Ah! What? Where are you? I'm um, in... Here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> oh, really? Uh, what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. 
Interesting. What's my article about? What? This one? people of, of uh, Bangkok and and the smog and how they, they can't uh, can't get a flight anywhere and people can't breathe <laughs> Wow right, I'm sorry no it was balanced Re I was, I was in the really ballpark right in a different state but yeah you were in a ballpark <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really. You know, I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't but seen him Elena, in about two years. Look, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? Look, I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Oh, just stop, I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked, I cleaned, it's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, uh play you for it you'll play me for yeah, it yeah 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 your little tv game thing i bet i can beat your high score you think that you can beat my high score on my tv game thing yeah i think you're scared now you don't even know what it's called i don't need to know what it's <laughs> called i've seen you play it's right. jumping and running and i have a natural talent oh, for that really? so what do you say chicken is it a bet oh wow okay cowboy Okay, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning, all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No. No, just, uh, how do you, uh, how do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Spin attack! Yeah, and press X to jump. Which one's X? The right thumb. Got it. You'll want to jump over all the pits and the obstacles. Come on, it's like my thing. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. What that spinning hurt? Oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. I don't know. How do I uh, climb back up? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I, I would have climbed back up. He should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Use your spin attack. That was that was not too bad. Jump over the pit. Well, he didn't jump far enough. What's the button for jump farther? Last life. You gotta make it count. Oh, I so got this. Jump, jump. Stop yelling at me. I'm encouraging you, I'm coaching you. Keep going, keep going. Watch that pit. Not enough womp of fruit to save that. Is that it? You asked for it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. 
I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good clean. Really? Really? You're going to start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, me. Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you going to do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you going to do? I'm warning you. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in real you. life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? <laughs> um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. Jesus, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. would have come back. I know, Nathan, I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. Hey, hey, you still with me? I need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. <laughs> it's a lot to digest, you know? <laughs> but how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, 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 slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. So what's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. Oh, geez, what crazy stories? Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. A few years back, I got roped into uh, breaking into this Turkish museum to steal this oil lamp, okay? Oil lamp? Uh, it was an artifact from Marco Polo's lost treasure fleet. Kubla Khan's treasure. Yeah. Yeah, and as it turns out, there was a whole hell of a lot more on those ships than just treasure. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and uh, we made it out alive. Barely. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring, the engagement ring. I'm married. I can't believe I, Elena from the stories. That's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner at my place. You're coming to dinner 
I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but, uh... Last year, he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading tonight. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> well, I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. Oh. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... ...become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. Mm. I like how he thinks. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> the opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segmenta aquí. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Señor. Todo va de acuerdo al plan, señor. Fantástico. How long have you had this plant? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. We're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Pedazo de Combate mierda. la puerta. Nunca saldrás de aquí. Silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You'll need this. You remember how to use it? Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector! You do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly! Háganlo! The cross up. Samuel, take cover. Get off my 
los vivos. Como quieras. Mátenlos a todos. You see? The plan's working. Yeah, I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. ¿Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind something. What? Why? Just do it. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Estamos bien. Las camionetas están en camino. Muy bien. ¿Y este gringo? Gringo está contigo. Estamos bien. Samuel, take cover. God. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready? Shit! Get on us! to go peace mode.
Shit! What the hell do we do now? Keep moving up! next for Samuel Drake, huh? mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I'm gonna take a bath. I'm gonna sleep on a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long? What do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh... I don't know, I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? It's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is? Yeah, uh, I do, okay, but... Listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very you think solid... I see Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it. Okay, I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is. I'm having all of these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. To you. How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Three months have the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure or do something really stupid like go to the authorities, I'll know. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. <laughs> Come on. No. Uh, 
nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it. Then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. Buena suerte, Samuel. So, Alcazar lets me go, and... Here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off, and... Wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. The moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet you Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And where are you going to get the money to outfit all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're gonna try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Uh... I don't know, like, uh, anybody, uh, Charlie Cutter. No. No, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got in that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. Oh, man. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar. Hey, hon, it's me. Yeah, uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but, uh... It's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. See anything yet? Just a bunch of high-class, low-life criminals all cleaned up for prom. <laughs> and no sign from Sullivan yet. Well, there's still plenty of time. It looks like the storage room's in the building behind the manor. You see it from up there? Just the very top of it. Oh, I wonder what they got tucked away in there. <laughs> Let's just focus on Avery's cross, okay? No, you sure you don't want to pick up something for the wife? It's cute. Let's keep it simple. Right, simple. It'd be a whole lot simpler if it was just the two of us. 
Sam, we could be inside already. Not cleanly. Have you even thought about a backup plan in case uh, Sullivan gets cold feet? No, because he won't. Or if he got caught? Sam, he knows the people running the auction. He's gonna schmooze his way right through that party, get upstairs, unlock the window, and we're in. It's a solid plan. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Good, say it. What if he stole the cross for himself? Not in a million years. Victor Sullivan. Say Victor we're talking about, right? Yes, he's double-crossed people in the past, but not us. No, not you. I know you two have never seen eye to eye. Huge understanding. But I trust him, all right? He's family. And, no, 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 no. I just need you to trust him, too. Fine, fine. He'll come through for us. Eventually. But I mean, come on, you have to at least just for one second consider the possibility. There. Hey. Trust. Just try to keep the tucks clean. Thanks. <laughs> I can't believe I'm out. Can't believe I'm here. You in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know. Uh, well, now the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh, uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like uh, third. What? Had a couple of odd jobs with Sullivan. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> okay. Man, there's no way up under that bridge. <laughs> well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Hey, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. Hey, uh... I missed. <laughs> uh, see, it's uh, it's all in the wrist. Here, let me see. Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. <laughs> So where to next? Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. Okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show-off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene lì sta. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vince. 
Inghilterra, traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renathug was packing some serious heat. Shut up our guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need them. All those years. It's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle. It's little things, but they add up. That should hold. Come on down. Landing's a little more painful than I remember. Yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, can you at least take any pictures? So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I can show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. <clears throat> Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. Oh, shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. It'd suck if you missed right now. It sure would. But I don't miss.
You all right? Yeah. How do I look? Like 400 million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <clears throat> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What? What about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Took a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's got to be something. The guards see us making for that cross. But they don't see us. Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical. That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. It'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? Hey. Mosse. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? A waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Huh? <laughs> that will work. All right, all right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room and kill the power. Me on the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. All right. You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything, uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right, listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll come through the cellar. Gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuck it up to go on vegan. Pardon me? Really? What are you doing? I uh, just going over our exit strategy. It's gonna get hairy. <laughs> Look, relax. We've pulled up tougher heist than this. Yeah, I know, I know. I just try not to imagine what they'll do if they catch us. Sam, if things go bad, we'll be dead long before they catch us. That's a comforting point. Yeah. I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a passable French accent. But then a few months back, I'm with my girlfriend by the Pompidou Tower. I've just sold them those pieces we, uh, yeah, obtained last year. You know, those hanging gold thing? I don't know, abstract art shit. Anyway, we walk out past that cellar de l'Empire. Cellar's just through there. Let's go. This place is fancy. Of course they played douchey European techno. Give me the spiazzi. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna be making episode what three and right now, so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick and shorty video. Bye!